Welcome to the Shark Tank here on EA Sports. James Sabalski with you. We're in the Bay Area tonight for a shark attack. Both teams are lined up and we are set to get things going. The Sharks start with possession as we are now underway. Nashville's got it along the wall. Puck knock loose in neutral zone. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. Sends the feet in front, and that goes off a stick and off target. Nice zone entry from the left. Shot, stones him in front. Puck is frozen, and we get a stoppage in play. Lots of time left in this period. Still looking for our first goal. Hurdles won the draw. Gives up the body as he lays out for the block. What a selfless play. And he'll hang on to the puck for a much-needed whistle. Well, and this is huge, James. The ability to slow the game down, get a line change. There's no one happier than the coach right now. Saros gives his team the confidence to make creative plays, knowing he can bail them out if needed. Hurdle's an important piece of this club. They'll be looking for him to produce. I'm expecting one of these two players to give their team the edge tonight. Guys, back to you. Moves it quickly over to Duclair. And that goes off a player in front. Nashville's got possession of the puck. Slides the puck over. Handles the pass. And he's got that one. And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here. One way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. Now he takes it over the line. Nashville's gained possession along the boards. Great heads up play with the stick by Caruso. Dismissed that chance. Dished on over to Couture. Quick feed to Hoffman. Great defensive effort with the stick. Saros has it and freezes the play. The Sharks win the draw, and they go on the attack here in the offensive zone. Oh, how did he get a piece of that? Beautiful feed up ahead from the right wing side. Feeds it on over to Addison. Here's a chance. Scores! And they are on the board quickly in this one. Well, it's because they were ready, James. I mean, the first five strides right from puck drop were urgent. And when you're aggressive and you're urgent on the puck, you find a way to put it in. Well, he fought for position to find this puck on his backhand, James. He was running out of real estate, but he was able to put it through and find the netting. Nashville's come to play tonight. They've been very aggressive to start, and as a result, Cheryl, they got the lead. Typically, the home team has the advantage, James. So when the away team comes into the barn, they want to make sure that they're not flat footed, that they're urgent, they're aggressive. And to start this period, to start the game, they've been ready right from the hop, and they're rewarded with a goal. On the one-timer! Oh, what a save on the one-timer! We're still in the early stages of this period. The Predators lead it 1-0. Tomasino's won it off the faceoff. Up along the wing. Fires it into the offensive zone. McDonald's lugging the puck. San Jose's moving it up the ice. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Stopped by the goaltender. Oh, and another beauty stop right there. Man, he was right on that puck. He knew exactly where it was. It was tight. Oh, he had a beat, but it goes off the inside post. Oh, he got out of that. What a save by Sellers. Well, this save looks easier than it actually is. I mean, when you have a shooter right in the slot, and you know that you've got to find a way to get your glove on it, you've got to be fast, you've got to be quick and show those reflexes. He does that and makes the save. San Jose's won the faceoff. Puck grab by Duclair. Snaps it on net. And that goes on someone in front and doesn't reach the net. Scores! He's on the board. Uh, and this is nothing new for him. His 20th goal of the season, James. Man, he's got an unbelievable ability to disguise his shot. Absolutely incredible. 
catching up to this puck. I mean, man, he put some hot sauce, some pepper, and some mustard on this quick release shot all at once. Nearing the midway mark of the period. It's all tied up. Hurdles won the draw inside the neutral zone. They'll go to work offensively here. And he keeps possession. Oh, how did he get a glove on that? What a stop by Saros. That's an incredible save, James. I mean, he's got presence in his crease, and he's also got a great glove hand, and he shows it right there with that save. The centermen glide into position. O'Reilly's quick stick off the draw wins possession. Now a quick pass to Barry. Taken down, the officials caught it. And let's see what the call is. The Predators are gonna be short-handed because of a tripping call. and release that puck high and get a goal. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. We got a tie game. The Predators get a hold of the draw. Quick pass to Hoffman. Puck scooped up by Couture. With possession along the wall. And that pass attempt is deflected. Moves it to Granlin. And not much on that one. Puck is frozen and will get a face off. 
Novak's been lighting the lamp at this point streak, playing so confident. He knows where he is on the ice, and it just seems that every time it makes its way towards the net, the puck's going in. O'Reilly's gained possession, and his great work inside the face-off circle pays off again. Moves it around along the half wall. San Jose's got control of it now from their own end. They put the puck into the offensive end. San Jose's got the puck along the boards. Decides to go to the end. Scores! The go-ahead goal puts them in front. Well, and this has been trending to happen, James. They've been closing on the puck to lead since an upward trajectory as this game's progressed and they find the back of the net. I love that he pounced on the puck right after the defensive zone turnover. He wanted to make good out of that costly turnover, and he does, sliding it right inside the post. San Jose's got a one-goal lead after that strike here in the first. Uh, it's all about quick strike, and now they've got the go-ahead, so they know that they can be confident with the puck, but they certainly can't sit back and protect it. Carpenter's quick stick lands from the puck here at center. Smith all alone! Oh, beautiful save in the play! And you gotta love these one-on-one -on -one battles. In particular, the goaltender so impressive, tracks the puck and makes the save. More than half the period has expired. The Sharks are looking to build on this one-goal lead. The Predators win it in the defensive zone. Slides the puck across to Sherwood. Moves it quickly over to Carpenter. San Jose's got him along the wall. Blocked in front. Tees him up. Stones him on the one-timer. Oh, he hit him and got all of it. Scores! Just a minute between those two goals. Quick response back to back here, and the team is humming. Yeah, I'm talking about putting your opponent on their heels. Love this goal, James. It's effort and skill all wrapped into one. He's stumbling. It almost looks like he's going to fall. But he uses that core athletic ability to hold on, find the puck, and get a shot off. That shot fools the goaltender. He's on the board. San Jose's clearly had a few energy drinks prior to puck drop because they're already up by a pair here in the first. It's always great to see a team come out and play with desperation, not just at the end of the game. There's been urgency to their step and a lot of pace to their play. Great use of the stick in the defensive end by Sherwood. Cunning's made an incredible play right there. I mean, he's stumbling. He looks like he's going to fall almost, but he's off balance, and that's the key. The puck isn't exactly where he wants it, but he still manages to find a way to get a shot off. And he takes the feed. And now it's grabbed by Sturm. Slides the puck down low. Quick feed to Sutherland. And he takes the feed. Too much traffic in the lane. The Predators gain control of the puck against the wall. Into the corner of the attacking area. Here's a short pass to O'Reilly. Picked up along the boards by Forsberg. Makes a save. Sends a pass over. From the point, looks to make something happen. Quick pass to Addison. And he made the save to keep that one out of the net. Oh, oh stops him again. There's the whistle. We'll get a face off after the goalie covers up. San Jose's opened things up here in the first as a result of their offense tonight. The Sharks take possession off the faceoff. That one misses and will play on. Well, you spend so much time trying to create scoring chances, and when you do, you got to find the back of the net. At the very least, hit it, James. Sent into the offensive zone. McDonald's taking it from his own end. Steps inside. Tenacious battle for the puck along the wall. And a heads-up kick pass over to his teammate. And that one's turned away. Takes the feed in the middle of the neutral zone. The Sharks gain control of it. Moves the puck into the attacking area. And that's a smart heads-up play by Evangelista. The Sharks gain possession along the wall. Slides the puck across to Evangelista. And it's a quick pass to McDonough. Here they come on the attack. Fires it! And the goaltender makes an easy glove save. Go 
San Jose's got the lead here late in this first period. And a solid job tying up his opponent. Granlin's gaining momentum. Takes the puck into the corner of the offensive end. Stops that one. Passes it to Shen. Carries the puck through the neutral zone. Moves it to Couture. Oh, smart heads up play to poke that one away. The Predators move the puck in the defensive zone. Pushes it across to Granlin. San Jose has gained the line and into the zone. Moves it quickly over to Granlin. And it's broken up by a nice defensive use of the stick. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Into the offensive zone. Fires it on net. That's gloved by Kakanen. In front and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Here in the late going of the frame, 4-2 is the score. The Predators take possession here inside the offensive zone. Made the stop on the play. Well, this save was way more difficult than it looked, James. I mean, there's so much traffic in front that he's fighting through to see, and he finds the puck to make the save. Nashville's got a hold of it against the wall. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Here's a shot! And he gets a piece of that one and denies it! Scooped up along the wall by Sherwood. Denied by the goaltender. And he scores! That's what you call having a knack for the net, James. When you get in tight and you're sniffing around, you better get that puck off quickly because you know there's defenders all in around you that are going to come and close. San Jose has been the better team here in this first period. More shots and more goals. Just a better all-around execution. And off the draw, they take the puck. The Sharks play it along the boards. Oh, they just got enough of that to keep it out. Goaltender covers it up, and we'll get a reset here. Puck possession so critical in today's game, and the official ready to drop the puck right here. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. The Predators have it now. Scores! And that one going off the defender for an own goal. James, how surprised do you think the goaltender is? He just spins around and tries to clear the puck, and he fires it past the tender. Here in the late goings of the period, San Jose's got a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. Sturms won the draw center. Quick feed to O'Reilly. Pumps it away in his own end. Grabbed along the board by Eklund. Poked away by McDonough. Moves the puck. And nearing the final 60 seconds of this opening stanza. Picked up along the wall by Sturm. Nashville's grabbed a hold of the puck. The Sharks gain possession in their own end. And he slides it quickly to Sederlund. And now he moves it quickly to Addison. Oh, complete explosion on that physical hit. Takes a shot. And he had an answer with that save. Shooters are so strong today on that cross crease pass. You've got to be able to read and anticipate that it's coming, and he does it perfectly. Shot, and he hangs on just as time runs out. And that concludes the first 20 minutes of play. Second period action. Stick around. The wise period two is set to go. Puck is dropped from the second stanza. Let's see if that action carries over from the first. 
Well, Cheryl, how do you sum this one up for the first 20 minutes? San Jose's got the majority of shots in this one, James, but this is a high-scoring affair. Both teams finding the back of the net multiple times because they've got that shot mentality, and that really started a few years ago, just disguising the shot, the individual skill set to be able to put it in. From the left side, moves it up ahead. Takes the feed at center and moves up ahead. And that shot dies in traffic. Gains the zone through center. Puck battle along the boards. The Sharks will play it from the defensive zone. San Jose is going on the attack as they gain the zone. Here's a shot, and that turns off a body in traffic. Into the attacking area from the left side. And the save. Kakanen's been bailed out by his team here, no question, James. I mean, he struggled between the pipes. They're doing everything they can to get on the board and keep this game in their favor. He's just got to take a breath there after that save and find a way to continue to make them. Couture's won the draw inside his own end. Takes the bank pass feed. Tries to dangle and the puck skips away. Oh, I know what he was trying to do there, James. He thought he had it with that move, but he created some space for himself, but unfortunately loses the handle and it dies on his stick. Down the right side and into the zone. Nashville's got control of it now here in the offensive end. The Sharks scoop it up along the boards. San Jose's on the attack. Here's the pass in front. And he denies that great opportunity there. Now he takes it over the line. Lead pass ahead. Stopped by the goaltender. Addison stick handling in his own zone. Puck grabbed by Couture. From the point, they take control of it. And that goes off a body. Solid hit on the play, and that knocks the puck off his stick. Here's a short pass to McCarron. He was totally locked in on that play. What a save from point-blank range. I mean, he's in fabulous position, square to the shooter in the slot, and he makes the glove hand save. Drops the hammer. Power forwards drive lanes, and they drive bodies, and that one's perfectly executed. Quick pass to Tomasino. Oh, he caught him. Oh, that's a thunderous hit along the boards. It's bone-crushing, James. You feel that one right from your toes all the way up to your shoulders. Talk about finishing a check. And the puck leaves the zone going back to center ice. San Jose's gained possession. Looking for space inside the D zone. Great use of the stick at center by McDonough. Oh, hammered over the boards, and look where he lands. Oh, man, he's in the laps of his opponent, and it's easier said than done to get out of there. You gotta scoop yourself up and get back over the boards. This is a tough one to take, real embarrassing. San Jose's got the puck along the wall. Loses his balance on the play. Moves it to Barry. The Sharks get a hold of the puck in their own end. San Jose's got it across the line. Oh, love the defensive stick work there to poke that one away. Quick shot, and that carries off a body in the lane. Gains the zone on the left wing. The Sharks carry it along the wall. Denies him in close. Well, that shot came quick, and it was right out front. He had to be sharp. He'd be right on it and show his brilliant reflexes. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. The Sharks holding down a 5-3 lead in what has been a fun one for hockey fans to watch tonight. And he slides it quickly to Nyquist. Moves it to the middle. Keeps it here. San Jose's got it in their own zone. Dumps it in. Nashville's got a hold of the puck now. Slides the puck to Forsberg. Nyquist's not going to be able to get away from the booze and the chance every time he touches the puck, all because of that play earlier where he hurt their player. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. And that goes off, pours off a body. Saros hangs on to the puck to stop the play. San Jose has been rewarded for their high activity in the offensive zone with lots of shots, and they lead it here in the second. 
Locks them up on the draw as they take possession. Slick feed. Chance in front. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? Goaltenders have to be able to read where the puck is going to, and he reads it perfectly as he has a strong push cross post and makes the save. Great use of the body to knock him off the puck. Glass looks around. Oh, and a smart heads up play. Moves the puck to Hoffman. Across the line and on the attack. Moves it quickly over to Couture. Nashville's got the puck in the defensive end. Fires it into the offensive zone. Slides it on over to Couture. Puck is picked up here in the neutral ice by Hoffman. Takes a shot. Oh, that save. Tremendous agility there by Seros. Takes the puck at the point and makes the save. Feeds the puck to Declare. San Jose's across the blue line. Moves it to the middle, and that's intercepted. San Jose's got the puck along the wall. And that's blocked from someone in front. Saros freezes the puck and opts for the whistle. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. Up to eight goals scored so far tonight. It's 5-3. They win the draw and go on the attack. Too much congestion in front. Stop! And they strike Pater once again. Yeah, they do. And their opponents down on their heels are deflated. They've got to find a way to continue with the pressure, be relentless, and try and get another one. Well, he's in tight to the net, James, and he knows that he's not going to have much time or space to get it off, so he elects to use the snapshot and beats the goaltender. The Sharks continue to hammer the accelerator here in the offensive zone tonight. They've been incredible almost through two periods of play here, and I mean, their ozone possession time is dictating it all. The ability to get to the net, and of course, the motion on the outside, which is disrupting the coverage and opening up the lanes. Oh, what a save! He stopped it! Wow! Oh, that's an intangible effort that you can't teach, James. That's all about desperation and the will to stop that puck. That makes the save. We got a whistle as the puck's frozen. San Jose's offense came to play in a big way, and they lead big time here in the second. The Sharks start with the puck in their own end. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Nashville's got the puck. And that's taken away in the offensive end by Sederlin. Denied by Seros. This is a fantastic save, James. He's all over it. What I mean by that is he knows exactly where it is and where it's moving, a reason why he can get square to it and make the save. Saros makes the save and hangs on for a stoppage of play. The Sharks are checking all the boxes tonight. More shots, more goals, and they lead in the second. Sturms won the faceoff here in the offensive zone. Smith scooped up the puck now here inside his own zone. Good heads-up defensive play as he extends the stick. Tries to get the puck to Sissons. Here's a chance! Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. Great positioning by the goaltender to redirect it to the corner, getting it out of danger. Poked away at center ice. Quick feed to Eklund. Nice save by the goaltender to get a pad on that. Can't complete the pass as it goes off a stick. Nice zone entry from the right side. Sends the feed in front, and he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Tries to feed it over to Declare. San Jose's got the puck against the boards. The Predators have it from their own end. Nashville's got a hold of the puck. Takes the feed. Too many bodies in the way. Taken by McDonald. From the neutral zone, moving forward here along the boards. Down the left wing, across into the offensive end. Oh, he makes the save, just got enough to keep it out. Well, these are the saves when you know that your goaltender is dialed in, James. The ability to get to the top of the crease and be square to the shooter, that's a great save. 
San Jose has had no shortage of scoring opportunities tonight, and they have capitalized on plenty as they take a sizable lead here late in the second. The Predators cross the blue line and are on the attack. Nashville's gained possession along the boards. Now a quick pass to Shen. Nashville's got it in their own zone. The Predators take it along the wall. Here's a shot. Oh, and that one comes up short as he just gets enough of that one. Sometimes goaltenders just make it look easy, James. And look at how big he makes himself in the net. Break away. Oh, a save on the play. Oh, that's such an athletic save, James. I mean, that's just all about competing, finding a way to get to the puck. A skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. And now it's grabbed by Nyquist. Takes the puck. And that shot gets caught in traffic. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Centering in front. And that's intercepted. Saros has the puck and holds on for a whistle. San Jose is up for good reason. They have been the more complete team offensively, which is why they lead late in the second. And they take possession after the defensive zone faceoff. The Predators have it now. Here they come. Here we go. Pucks in deep. Ferraro's got it in the defensive end. You gotta figure he knows about this next milestone. He's only one goal away. The Sharks get a hold of the puck along the boards. Here's a chance. Picked off in front. Nice zone entry from the middle. The Sharks get a hold of it. Here's an odd man rush. Oh, how did he keep it out? What a blocker stop by Saros. Nashville's got the puck against the half wall. Oh, gets a glove on it to make the stop. Blocked in traffic with the stop. Puck picked up by Ruda. Gaining momentum up along the side. The Predators gain control of the puck. From behind his own cage, he grabs the puck. And that's knocked away. Nashville's got just a few seconds left here with the puck. The Predators gain possession. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. Hard hit frees up the puck. And that'll bring an end to the second period of play. Let's get a clean sheet of ice and come back with the third period next. Responsible. The Sharks will play it in their own end. And he's ridden off the puck. On the attack along the boards. Huge steal in his own end. Here's a short pass to Barry. And that's intercepted in the defensive end. Straight up the middle. Here they come. We got a stoppage. Let's get the call. The body language on the bench says it all, James. They're all looking up at the time on the clock to see if it'll continue to run because they got to kill off this penalty when they're down a bunch of goals. I won't be surprised to see the 1-3-1 again. They had success on it earlier, James. And listen, I love this. I coach this with my team because I love the bumper spot and I love the net front player. You're taking away the eyes of the goaltender, but you can also pop out below the goal line and present as an option. So multiple variations that can strike. Quick pass to Granlin. Trying to get back on the attack now. Feet out front. Oh, and they couldn't complete that. Point blank stop by Saros. Look at this attack here in the ozone. Here's a hit. Oh, it stays out. What a save on the play. Pressure saves right there. And there's the whistle. As the goaltender will hang on. Well, here we go. Big time face-off in the offensive zone for this 
power play unit. Uh, and they haven't made any mistakes, right, James? They're moving the puck. They're finding ways to attack the net. They just haven't put it in, and they're up against a tired Colton, but they got to smell blood, and they got to put it away. Oh, my goodness, it's Tina. What a save. It was all but in, James, and that athleticism and the will to get to that puck, that was on display. The Sharks have it against the wall. Gaining momentum along the wing. And he can't hang on after that hit. Into the offensive end now. And they continue to apply pressure here. Nashville's got a hold of it along the wall. Looking to break it. One on one with the goaltender. Oh, what a fantastic save there. Oh, he's got such quick hands, but he's in tight. And when you move them fast, you don't force them to move. And the goaltender is able to read it, track it, and make the save. And he takes the pass. Center and feed. And that shot's blocked. Gets in front of it. More time off the clock as they grab the puck. Moves it to Coonan. My goodness, this has been a pressure-filled shift here. Taken along the wall by Coonan. Takes the feed. Eklund's lugging the puck. And it's a quick pass to Duclair. From along the boards, moves the puck ahead. And the play continues. Quick pass to Novak. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. And he slides it quickly to Coonan. San Jose's on the attack. Moves it quickly over to Hoffman. Here we go, two on one. Dishes it off. Oh, it's stopped. Oh my goodness, what a save. Moves the puck into the attacking area. Can't get it to go. The Predators gain control of the puck against the wall. Smith's got it in the offensive zone. The Sharks take possession in the defensive end. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Nashville's looking to break out. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Receives the pass. Oh, a tremendous save on the play! Scores! And my, oh my, how things have suddenly changed here! Well, it's the magic of one goal and the impact it can have, James. You go from a situation where you think you're out of it, and now all of a sudden you believe you're back in it. Complete change of the dynamic of the game. I love when offense is generated from below the goal line. All of the coverage is facing the puck, and he gets lost in coverage in that slot area and just fires it home. The Predators haven't had a lot of things go their way tonight, but they finally got a positive here in the third. They're going to have to outnumber their opponent if they want to call back from this two-goal deficit. They're running out of runway. They're going to find a way to get some chances. Nashville's got possession of the puck. Moves the puck over to Sherwood. in front. Well, this is an incredible save, James. It's anticipation as well. Recognize that the shooter is in the low slot, getting in front of it and making the save. The Sharks have shown no signs of stopping, putting pucks on net, and they lead it here in this third. And they win the offensive zone face-off. Now let's see if they can capitalize. What a block as he lays out in front of it. And he gives it over to Eklund. Oh, and a good textbook hit there. Takes it into the slot. And play continues as that goes off the glove. Good hit to bump him off the puck. Quick feed to Ruda. Along the half wall with the puck. And reads the play perfectly and picks off the pass. Shot denied by the goaltender. Covers it up and will get a stoppage in play. See if we can pick up some momentum again here as a face-off is ready to go. San 
Jose's won the defensive zone draw. The Sharks cross the line and gain the zone. Handles the puck. Just a little too much contact and couldn't hang on to the puck. O'Reilly's moving the puck through his own zone. Here's a short pass to Nyfist. Nashville's got the puck along the boards. Comes up with the stop. Every coach is going to tell you, get in front of the goaltender and take away their eyes. It was the goaltender's job to find the puck. He finds it and makes the save. Hurdles won a big draw on their own end. With possession along the wall. Penalty coming up here. Well, he doesn't like it, but he's going to get the charging call here, and it's earned. I mean, he came from distance, he didn't slow down, and he got all of his check. As we're about to drop the puck, the power play unit back get out of the ice for another opportunity. They've already scored on the power play tonight, James, and if it ain't broke, you don't fix it. The coach has got them all ready to go fired up. They've worked endlessly on this setup. And man, is it working tonight. The Predators looking against the half wall. And there's the save. Quick pass to Barry. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. Hammers it on net. Stop that one. Ref blows the whistle as the puck's covered up. New Jersey's coming up next on the schedule. Get your tickets. It should be a good time. All right, well, we got a breather in action. Let's check in with our own Carlin Bay the ringside. Hurdles has been exciting again tonight, guys. He gets in on the box score, and you can bet he'll feel satisfied with his contributions. Went for the dirty dangle, and it goes sideways. There's the whistle. Let's get the call from the officials. The Sharks are getting penalized for slashing. for both sides a little bit here with some four-on-four -four action. On a four-on-four, -four, you can expect all players on the ice when you're possessing the puck to activate. You have to be able to support the puck carrier, and if you're a defender, you know you're jumping into a lane going north. Slides the puck ahead to Hurdle. Shot, and it goes right off his bucket. And now he moves it quickly to Ruda. Wrist shot from the slot. Big save. This is a really nice save, James. I mean, the shooter's in the middle of the ice. He's in the slot area. And he's got to get to the top of the crease, square to the puck to be able to make that save. Great job. Good hit. Nashville's in now. Gives him a tap with a stick, and the referees don't like it. Let's get the official decision. Bennings hack, not a popular one of the eyes of the officials here. The Predators with a four-on-three power play coming up. Four-on-three can be so effective. You know that they've worked on these situations in practice. They'll look to set up the one-timer, look for guys switching sides. So much motion and opportunity. An easy save by Kakanen. Trying to clear the zone. And they get the puck out, and they needed that. Uh, they certainly did. This PK unit has been on fire. They get the clear. That's one. You kill valuable time. That's two. And now three. You can contest the entry. That's a great play all the way around. Carpenter's gliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. And they win the draw here in their own end. Gets it out of his own end. Nashville's got it in the offensive zone. Trying to clear the puck. And he gets the job done. Big thumbs up clearing that one. Duclair's out of the sin bin and joins the penalty kill here. Scores! On the man advantage, they put one home. And this is exactly why you spend so much time in practice working on specialty teams, James. You can see that good movement to open up lanes, just disrupt the box there, and they're able to cash it in. There it is, and he's leading his team in goals for a reason, James. He's got a real knack for the net and uncanny ability to disguise his shot. 
Nashville's finally shown some pushback in the third, and they've got a goal here. It's amazing, James, how a game can change within the game, and that happened right there on that last sequence. Getting to the middle of the ice, fighting for possession, and that's a sense of urgency late in the third. Picked up along the boards by Trevor. And the puck stopper hangs on to get a breather here for the team. The Sharks continue to lead here in this third period. They've been the busier team offensively. Couture's gained possession and his great work inside the face-off circle pays off again. Nashville's looking to break out of their own end. Moves it to Smith. Nashville's ready to go on the attack. Quick feed down low. They fight for it along the boards. And he slides it quickly to Lozon. Great use of the twig as he pokes that one away. The Predators gain possession along the wall. Puck scooped up by Granlin. What an entertaining game, James. A lot of goal calls for you as it's been back and forth action in the offensive zones. Not much defensive structure to this one as everyone's looking to attack. Puts it on net. Oh, he gets a blocker on it. What a stop by Kakanen. And he'll take a moment to regroup back at center. Good read with the stick to break that up. Nashville's got a hold of the puck now. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Now he slides it up to Evangelista. And that's stolen in the offensive zone. Scores! Deuces wild as that's his second of the game. Well, he's got two tallies on the score sheet, James, but I love his game off the puck as well. I think that he's had a hard nose on the forecheck. He's hounded it, he's hunted it, and guess what? He's been rewarded for his efforts. Been the better team tonight, Cheryl. Look at this. They've got the extra goal now here late in this third. Yeah, and that's a huge goal, James, right? It gives you the extra cushion. It's kind of an insurance mark. You know they're going to try and pull their tender late in the third. So now you got a little more breathing room in this one. They go on the attack from the left side. Uses the force on that hit. And we've got an offside with a face-off looming. The Sharks aren't far from the finish line now as they lead it late in this third period. And off the face-off, they take possession. Here's a chance to make something happen inside the neutral zone. Can't hang on to the puck after taking a knock. Sends it out in front! Oh, and he comes up with a stop! And too much traffic in front blocks that one. Good hit on the play. Stoppage in play as the puck goes up and over. We'll get a face-off. This is a face-off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. And they win the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. Denies that opportunity. Hoffman's moving it ahead. Moves it quickly over to Couture. They score! here you can get the opportunity but you have to execute that's two in a row high level goaltenders use tracking exercises all the time both on and off the ice you can see the frustration after the goal as he's trying to find this he's trying to out battle but he can't get a sight line and it winds up in the back of the net San Jose's performance tonight still showing no signs of let up here in this third period. Well, they've had such an impressive performance, James. It's been dominant in all areas of the ice, and there's been no lag or no let up. The message has been clear by the coaching staff as well as everyone on the bench. Keep pushing. Big save by the goaltender watching that one. And there's another stop. Well, he has been under siege. I'm loving his compete level. I mean, he's making consecutive saves one after another. Sends it quickly to Barry. That's just a great heads up read at center ice. Oh, and he whiffs. Scooped up along the wall by Ruda. Turned aside by the goaltender. Inside the offensive zone, takes the pass from along the boards. Makes the save, cool and cool under pressure. San 
and Jose is up big time here in the late stages of this third period. And they win the draw in the offensive zone, and they go to work. Quick feed to Eklund. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. The Predators take it along the wall. And they'll dump it in. Bruda's got the puck in his own zone. Slides it over to Sturm. Tries to make a move and can't hang on to the puck. Well, he's showing off his skill set, trying to make a silky move around the defender, but he gets denied. Sends it over. Nashville's got the puck inside the defensive zone. He's got a step. Stopped on the breakaway. What a save he made there. Well, I loved how he challenged the shooter on this, James. He didn't sit back in his net. He came right out to the top of the paint. He said, if you're going to beat me, you got to find room. San Jose's offense, the story tonight as they lead it here in this third period. Hurdles won it in their own end. The Sharks move the puck in the defensive zone. Duclair is going to play it against the half wall. And some good footwork to kick it away. Good, solid check, and he loses control of it. Takes a shot, and he gets in the lane to block that. The Sharks take it along the wing. What a read by the goaltender! Final seconds of this one, and the home fans certainly appreciate that they got their money's worth tonight. Teams are lined up, and we are ready to take this draw. San Jose's got the puck inside the offensive zone. Nashville's got the puck along the wall. Long lead pass into the neutral zone. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. And there's the final horn, putting a bow on this one here this evening. San Jose's effort was a dominant one. Cheryl, they controlled play in every corner of the game tonight. They really did. It was like they were playing a game of keep away. And remember, remember those when they were young, James? Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, they held the puck and they had the work to do with it. But they found a way to create opportunities because they worked hard away from it as well. No one could get it off their stick. Great night of action on the ice, and I can't wait to do it again. I know you can't wait either, so we'll see you next time, and we'll see you back.